I'm receiving a lot of questions about Dragon Frame, Arduino, Stepper Motors and drivers. So today we'll take a look at this driver, the A4988. Uh, this is a Polulu driver and it's really cheap. It's like 5 euros uh, the driver. So I will explain you the cheapest configuration to activate and program a stepper motor using Dragon Frame and it is by using this driver. And you will need an Arduino Uno board, the driver itself, the A4988, a 100 microfarads capacitor to prevent from voltage spikes, some jumpers or wires to make the connections, a breadboard to test the circuit, a stepper motor like an EMA17, and a 12 volts power supply. Plug the driver, then a 100 capacitor, this size, then I will drop here to explain you better. plus, minus, here we connect the, the power for the motor, ok, then one coil and another coil the motor I will use this motor and then first coil and Second coil, then we connect this to the three volts here. and the ground ground also to the board next and um, the most important is direction number five and the step to number four this is our channel number one in in dragon frame then we loop the reset and the slip You will find the Arduino code in the Dragon Frame folder. In Resources, Arc Motion Control, DF Moco, and it's this one. If you open it in Arduino, you must install the application. But if you open, you will see this uh, code with all the pins in the Arduino. Step direction, step direction. Clicking here, it uploads the, the code to the Arduino. Then we can open Dragon Frame, go to Scene, Connections, 
and connect this one the armoco one connect it says the port to connect okay and when once it's connected in the arc motion control tab we'll find the timeline so we will need to add our motor it will be in the arc moco one and channel one and we can configure some of these options now we have here the motor we can start start by clicking different positions and modifying all the keyframes <laughs> 